Hello students, welcome back to the third day of first grade. First, second, third day of first grade. Let's have a nice stretch and enjoy our breathing. So remember, you need to find a place where you have a little space. Have your feet shoulder width, right? As wide as your shoulder, shoulder width apart. And let's get ready to take a deep breath and blow all our air out like a loud balloon. Here we go. <laughs> all the way into downward frog. When I wiggle down here, I feel a nice stretch in my ankles. I feel a nice stretch in my knees. I feel a nice stretch in my hips. Now, I'm gonna stretch my legs. Remember, drop your head down. Try to keep your hands on the floor. Here we go. Oh, what a nice stretch. Now, I'm gonna roll up. Okay, so I'm sure my feet are still shoulder width apart. My arms are hanging at my sides. My legs are straight, but not stiff. Not stiff, my knees aren't locked, but my legs are pretty straight. And I'm gonna gently close my eyes and breathe in and out. Oh, I feel so strong and calm, like a strong, calm mountain. When I breathe in, and out, I can imagine my feet go all the way to the center of the earth, just like a mountain. I'm so strong and calm. Breathing in and out, and in and out. Gently open your eyes. So I hope you enjoyed that moment of peaceful breathing, and I'll be back in a minute to teach you our new song. Welcome back students. It's time to learn our new song. Though many of you may already know it, there's a clue about the song on the whiteboard. And if you already know it, then you'd be reviewing it or relearning it. Remember re at the end of a word means you're doing something over again. So let's take a look at the song. Did you guess what it was already? Yeah, it's bingo. May I have my cute little dog? So the way this goes is, let's just read it first. There was a farmer had a dog and bingo was his name. -o. B -I -N -G -O, B-I-N-G-O, 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 and bingo was his name. -o. Okay. Let's go ahead and sing it one time, still looking at the little poster. Here we go. There was a farmer had a dog and bingo was his name. Oh, B-I-N-G-O, 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 and bingo was his name. Oh. Okay, so now, we're going to sing the song, but there's something special about singing the song I think that some of you know, is that you do some clapping while you sing the song. So this is how it goes. First, you just sing the whole song the way we did. Then when you sing it the second time, you do this. You say, there was a farmer had a dog and bingo was his name, Mo. Okay, this time you can see that the letters B-I-N-G-O we don't say the B and instead we clap. So we go I N G O I N G O I N G O and bingo was his name oh there was a farmer had a dog and bingo was his name oh two claps N G O Okay you get the idea? So let's go back to the beginning and do the whole thing together and I'll try to help you remember how many times to clap, okay? And I'll take away the letters so you can know where we're at, okay? There was a farmer had a dog and bingo was his name, oh. B-I-N-G-O, B-I-N-G-O, 
B-I-N-G-O and Bingo was his name-o. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name-o. I-N-G-O, I-N-G-O, I-N-G-O and Bingo was his name-o. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name-o. Two claps. N-G-O, N-G-O. N-G-O and Bingo was his name-o. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name-o. Three claps. G-O. G-O. G-O and Bingo was his name-o. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name-o. Four claps. O. O. Oh, and Bingo was his name. Oh, there was a farmer had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, all claps. <laughs> and Bingo was his name. Oh, okay. I hope you enjoyed learning or reviewing that song, and I'll be back with you in a moment with our message. Welcome back, students. Let's take a look at our message. September 10th, 2020. Dear students, today we will keep learning names by clapping the syllables in our names. Mrs. Kilmer. Let's reread that to be sure we understand what we'll be doing today. Dear students, today we will keep learning names. So we're going to keep learning and remembering each other's names by clapping the syllables. Clapping the syllables in our names, Mrs. Kilmer. So, hmm, syllables. This word here, syllables, what is a syllable? I think some of you know. But syllables are like the chunks of sounds in a word and in our names. So for example, my name, I, you know me as Mrs. Kilmer, but my first name is Beverly. Here's a new fun fact, my name is Beverly. So if I wanted to clap the syllables in my name, I would go Beverly, right? Beverly. So the reason we're learning to clap the syllables in our name is because tomorrow I'm gonna teach you a fun clapping game that we can play with each other to practice our names. So what I want you to do today at home is be thinking about your name and practicing clapping the syllables, okay? So that's the first thing you have to do to, to be able to play the game. So if your name is Maria, it would be like Maria. How many syllables? Did you guess? Three, right? Maria. Hmm. Let's think of another name. Hmm. How about um, John? Here we go. John. How many syllables in that? Right? Just one. Uh, let me think of another name. Hmm. How about Rosario? Ooh, that's a little long. Rosario. Let me clap it. Rosario. 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 Oh, four syllables, right? So I want you to be sure that at home you practice clapping the syllables in your name. And I also want you to Practice a little clapping pattern that will help us tomorrow. So the clapping pattern is pat, pat. So it's a little hard for you to see. Let me tip the camera down a little so you can see maybe that I'm clapping on my knees. Okay, so I'm going clap, clap. Uh, sorry, tap, tap, clap. Tap, tap, clap. Tap, tap, clap. Tap, tap, clap. So I also want you to practice that at home. Let's do it together for a little bit. Here we go. Ooh, it's kind of a tongue twister if you try to say it at the same time. Here we go. Tap, tap, clap. 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 Okay, so I want you to practice two things for tomorrow. Clapping the syllables in your name. So, Beverly. Tap, tap. Tap, tap, clap. Hmm. Rosario. Tap, tap, 
clap, tap, tap, clap, tap, tap, clap. Okay, so practice your tapping and your clapping and your syllable clapping, and we'll be all ready for our fun game tomorrow. Okay, I'll see you later.